welcome to John's Metal Detecting Adventures. Here we are searching for history and today we're on some fields where the old Arkley's Jam used to be on these slopes. So we're looking at history maybe going back to 18 and maybe further. Let's see what we're going to find today. Twenty. I'm sort of tag. I'm sort of tag, I think, Mabry. We've got some horses here, haven't we? Yes. I'm not frightened, no. Big, aren't they? Yes. Very big. Ah, ha, ha, I think we got one. We got a silver. There you go. At least we got a bit of silver. Silver sixpence. George the fifth. Always happy to see silver. So I've been shooting the muskets around here. Nothing century belt, probably. Unusual pattern. And that was 32. George the uh, sixth half penny. Not a very good nick, but it's probably 1940s or something like that. Yeah, and I found a watch. Probably 1950s. Got another belt on. Probably an expensive one. It's blank at the bottom. Oh, I do like the balls and look. There you go, it's in there. 25, 26. What is it? Ready? Here we go. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, uh, I think I can see edge counter, can you? Uh-huh. That's a George. George the third, half penny. At least we can see the green. <laughs> it's as far as it goes. Yeah, George Sixth Penny. Daddy a penny. Does it out? Check it out. Well, we found some sort of badge down there. It's a huge thing it is. I don't know if it's silver or what, but the size of that. There's a crown on. Now, whether that belongs to Hartley's Jam, I'm not sure, but interesting. Oh, what? Look at that. The size of that. Probably lead, but still interesting. You know the George uh, Edward the Seventh, half penny. Yes, George the uh, Fifth, half penny. Oh, hey, it is. Yeah! <laughs> oh, lovely! Nice bit of silver there. We're in silver. Excellent. Yeah. Shilling. Victoria. Oh, yes. I always like this bit of silver. Brilliant. Bit of a fancy um, 17th century buckle. Belt buckle. Yeah. A button. Fancy pattern. 